Hi guys, and welcome back to the Schnelbs Plays Splunky. We're gonna get back in here again with another adventure in the Splunky universe. And we've got our glasses on and we're ready to look at it all and experience it all. We're gonna see whatever comes at our faces behind these, these very helpful, useful pieces of glass that we put in front of our eyes that make things look better. Also known as glasses. Anyways, so here we are, and I believe we're in episode 13 already. It could be one off, but I'm pretty sure we're only on 13 so far. Um, maybe 14. I I don't know. I sometimes I lose count. Sometimes I forget, and I have the ooh, <laughs> and I don't have the ability to count. But um, so we're gonna kind of try to concentrate here a little bit better. So far, so bad. To be quite honest with you, let's get rid of those webs because I hate them. And there's a spider there, but he's okay. He won't bother us until we come back on our way this way. And so is he going to jump down here? Hey, come on. Get down to my level. There we go. I'll just go up to his level and kill him in the face. Okay, so let's get up this rope. Our little acrobatic lass here. And there's gold down there, which is probably... Yeah, it's fine probably not gonna get crushed and it didn't so I think this down here is probably the most worth you could ever get out of a bomb I mean look at this there's crates there's a lady there's more bombs it's just perfect this is exactly the kind of trade that I would love to do every time look at that we got six bombs for one bomb and we get a, a beautiful cherry on top lovely lady in red perfect woman and I think we're gonna actually just use another bomb since we got so many just now we can afford to use a bomb here to drop down go to the exit and leave wow I did not mean to <laughs> leave all that gold sitting there actually I'm sure some of you are gonna get like really angry about that and be like what did you do you left gold just sitting there at the exit but um I accidentally hit the button because the bat you know, scared me, so, uh, oh, hey, I should have totally landed on that guy, what the heck gives there, that was stupid, okay, anyways, um, oh yeah, I left that gold there, because I panicked, basically, um, but, you know, regardless of panicking, we did get some pretty good stuff there at the very end of that level, we got lots of bombs, and we got the damsel, which I promptly gave up in the form of two hits of damage, but that's okay, because, um, we're still moving on here, and you know, two health is better than none, so. And is there something I could buy down there? There's a mystery box, you know, that's kind of tempting for me, I don't know, I think I have enough gold for it, but let's just double check that there's nothing over here of note on this side. No, okay, we're good. So we're just gonna run our little tukuses all the way back to this shop here, and I'm gonna buy the mystery box. Mostly because I'm a sucker for surprises. I absolutely love- Oh, come on. I love surprises, but this crazy gun freaks me out. I don't think I've ever even used this before. What is this? Um, it's a freeze ray. Um, <laughs> let's see. Oh god, what did I just do? Oh god! Oh my god. <laughs> I thought that it would just- Okay. Okay, I thought it would just, like, freeze him and leave him there for a while, but he did not stay frozen as long as I needed to figure out what the hell I had done. So, alright, I'm not gonna say that that was, like, a suicide mission, but I just wanted to see what would happen if I freeze raid the shopkeeper. Okay, you can't judge me, I was just being all adventurous and clever, so I did that, and that's okay. I think we're gonna get over it. <laughs> And so we're gonna start another run here. We got some TNT here, which we're just gonna breeze over. Oh, did not see that spider there. I was too busy looking at this rat. You know, sometimes I don't know if Spelunky is the game for me because I find myself just collecting. Oh, jeez, and I just threw that rat like face first. But anyways, I, I do, I do like to just pick up those little rats because it's fun to catch them. You know, just running around catching rats. Just feel like a child. Okay, there's a damsel, and it doesn't look like we have to use a rope to get to her, so woo, run, run, run. Oh, and run, and oh no. Oh my god. So, so far so bad, and we're gonna concentrate a little bit more here, I think, actually. Um, 
and this looks like it might be worth it. Yes, it will be, and we're gonna just- oh, yeah, good. Um, I was hoping that my rope would get to that spider before he dropped, so he- and it did, so that's good. So we're just gonna run up here, we're gonna drop a bomb down, and we're gonna get this gold while we wait. And we're gonna get this crate, which is hopefully something good. Good, bombs, that's perfect. That is exactly what I wanted out of that crate, so. Bombs are good. And we're gonna use, uh, oop, damn it, I always do that wrong. Uh, we're gonna use an... There we go. Uh, so I wasted a rope there, but that's okay, because it was worth it to take care of those, um, those arrow traps, which is no problem for us. And I don't know if we can get to this area. We might be able to without using a bomb, so let's just kind of drop down here and see how it goes. See what we can find, and it looks like we could use a rope. But, frankly, I would really like to use a bomb. Oh no, I think I jumped down the wrong way. Yeah, this is bad. Um, since we only have one rope, I think it's smart to use maybe two bombs to get over here. Oh, right? I mean, am I wrong on this? I don't think I'm wrong on this. I think if I use two bombs here, that crate could have something great in it, right? And we can definitely get to the crate with just using those. Oh! And we hit the bat, which is good for me. And, oh, look at that, 12 bombs. There was a freaking bomb box in that crate. I think that was the smartest thing I have ever done in my Splunky career. And that was great. So, no, oh, <laughs> I thought it was going to take fall damage. No complaints there. So we're going to kill this bat. We're going to, oh, I wanted to try to jump over there to the damsel. Maybe I can get to her. Let's see if I can do some crazy, oh, yep, perfect. Perfect platforming. And the ghost is probably going to come pretty soon here. So let's... Let's get the hell out of Dodge, is what I was gonna say. So, we're chugging along here, chugga 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 chugga, and we got a big smoocher on the way into the next level, and we're on the mines part one, dash two. And I think this spider will not be a problem. And he's just gonna do a little bit of monkey in the middle right above us, and I think I can get the upper hand on him. Yes, there we go. So I got the upper hand, and I'm going to take this rock here and try to use it on this bat, but maybe I'll miss. No, I didn't miss. Okay, good. And I'm not going to go up to the top there just to get that wrap because, you know, I am tempted just because it's fun, but I'm going to concentrate here because it's much more important, and I, I could get the out one up there too, but I don't want to because I have bigger and better things to do, like killing spiders and picking up rubies and smashing pots when I really should pick them up first. All in the plant. Oh, jeez. I thought I was gonna land on that, um, snake there. That's why I kinda just jumped down. I think I should take less risks. I just, I'm just, like, going crazy in this game. Like, oh, fall damage? I don't take fall damage. Oh, snakes? Oh, I'm just gonna land right on their heads. I don't even worry about it. What are you talking about? You worry about snakes? What's wrong with you? Apparently, that's just how I feel about everything in life. Um, compass? Yes. Climbing gloves? Yes. Bomb box, wish, bomb bag, sure. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Um, you're welcome for my business, uh, Ron. That's a very good name for you, Mr. Ron. Uh, thank you very much. And there's lots of pots here, so let's just uh, take the damsel to the exit. Oh, that skeleton just went back to sleep. He's like, I'm awake. Ah, oh, nah. Hit the snooze button. I don't want to give up yet. So there's the damsel. That's good. So let's go back over here and take care of these pots because you never know. There could be a big hunk of gold in there, just like that one had. There could be big hunks of rubies, or big hunks of nothing. Either way, it's always worth it. So, let's just go through the exit now. Perfect. And we're on the mines. I think we're on 1-3? Yeah, perfect. And we did get a big ol' smooch on this one as well, which makes up for some damage that I've taken. Uh, the damage I took against that snake, specifically. Because I did take- oh! <laughs> I got a little nervous there that I wasn't going to be quick enough on the draw, but I did take uh, damage against the snake, so that's alright to, you know, the damsel makes up for that. So let's jump down this way, because it seems relatively safe, and let's kill the snake and kill that snake. Oh, and that um, TNT uh, box crate majig totally blew up over there on that side, so I'm glad that I was not over there when that happened. Are you going to turn around? No. Okay, that snake's out of our distance, but this bat's here, and now the snake is here. Okay, perfect. And we're gonna pill, or we're gonna pick up that, and I'm glad I didn't just smash that one, because as you can see, it had a snake in it, so I I gotta get smarter with that, and I think I am. So I already have a compass, so it'd be weird to buy another one. 
Um, let's buy piles of ropes just in case. I really should have bought the parachute. Um, because I do take some weird damage. And I don't really know why I bought all those ropes just now, actually. Now that I think about it, I had the climbing gloves. So that was actually really silly. <laughs> but, you know, whatever. You can't blame me. I do usually like to stock up on resources because, you know, if you find yourself in a tight situation, you want to have as many resources as possible. And I feel really comfortable here with 10 ropes and uh, 19 bombs, so... I am not complaining at the moment. So let's drop the damsel off, and I don't really think there's anything else for us up here, so let's just get out of here before this bat comes up and bites us in the ass. You know what I mean? And I really don't want to get bit in the ass by bats. I'm sick of bats. Um, so I'm sick of bats, and here comes another one. Look at them just flapping their stupid wings. Just, they can't wear purple, all right? This ass right here is an ass that can wear purple. Bats. Ooh, wow. <laughs> oh my god. Rewind. Screenshot that. I just whipped an arrow back at the arrow trap as it came at me. That is unbe freaking leaveable. My god. Okay, don't get too excited because I was just, you know, that's a minor thing there. But my god. Oh. <laughs> Hello, spider. Goodbye, spider. Um. My god, that was amazing. Did you see that? If you didn't see that, I would totally just go back a little bit. I don't really know what time it happened, but I might figure that out later. But my god, that was amazing. Tell me if you guys have done that before, because I have never seen that happen before. And I've played a bit of Spelunky and seen people play a bit of Spelunky in my day, so I've never seen it before. Maybe I'm just totally sheltered and it happens all the time, but I doubt it. So that was cool. And there's the spitting... Oh! Damn it, spitting snake, that guy had some freaking distance on that thing, look at that. Wow, okay. Well, he's dead now, so he had some distance on that. Um, another bat? Good job, me, I'm getting good on the, that backlash, too. Um, there's a pot here, and there's, oh, that's good. I shouldn't have ran over that skeleton, but I got pretty lucky there. And we're gonna run this way, and I didn't see the damsel, unfortunately. Um... Unless she's over here on this side. I don't know, I didn't even hear her. Maybe she was already dead or something. Let's look up. Um, I don't know, there's a lot of spitting snakes on this level, so even if she was still alive... I oh, damn it! Now I really want to look for the damsel because that's... I didn't... I thought I could, like, see how I jumped, like, here, and then... I don't know, I shouldn't have jumped. I, I do that a lot. I jump before I go over cliffs all the time, so... Let's just go down with three health. I'm not sure I could take any more damage if I tried to look up for the damsel, and I probably would. So we're gonna head into the jungle here. Wish I had five health instead of three, but that last arrow trip just got to or arrow trap, sorry, ooh, just got to me. There's an ash grave here. I have heard from uh, reputable is that a good word? Reputable sources that you can get oh, and um, a shotgun for free, and there it is. So let's just drop down here into the middle and grab the shotgun and get out of there. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> and that was the death of me. You see what happens when you give firearms to a little girl with glasses? Did you really think that was going to be a good idea, Schnelz? No. No, 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 no. That was the, probably the worst thing <laughs> I have ever decided to do. Just because you can do it just goes to show you you don't always need to do it and it's not always the best thing for you to do so that's a bummer because that run was going pretty well um but you know needless to say I've learned my lesson I actually admittedly haven't used the shotgun very much so as you can tell I did not really uh, understand the knockback that it uh, that it gives to you there so I did uh, <laughs> got shot over there, but that's okay. That's probably what would happen if I actually tried to use, um, if I tried to use, like, a real gun, like, I would just get thrown back. Oh, God. You can, like, see me with, like, a rifle or something. I don't even know what kind of guns are out there. Rifles. Bazooka. <laughs> Bazooka, that's a kind of gun, right? Yeah, whatever. I'm not a big firearms kind of person. Anyways, so we're gonna trigger this arrow trap, and we're gonna try to forget about our rifle shotgun nightmares that existed on the last floor and I think I did I see the damsel and just like ignore her because I think I did I think I was shunning the damsel in all my discussion about firearms she was over here wasn't she was she yeah she was <laughs> there she is okay so oh 
Okay, let's go this way and see if there's a good way. I don't really think there's much of a good way to get to her. Oh, now I gotta use another rope, I think, unless I can do some crazy good platforming up here. Let's see. Oh, jeez. Woohoo! Yes, I can. All right, so looks like we could use another rope and another bomb maybe over here. Let's see. How did I get so far down already? God, I was like speeding it. Let's see. Go up there. That's good. So, yeah, this is fine. Um, sort of. Let's just use a bomb here. This, this is good. Okay. Um, we're getting it together. Let's go. Oh, oh, parachute. Thank you very much for procking at the proper time there for me. And we're gonna run over here. Oh, I'm still not high enough to get to the damsel. What did I do there? I'm freaking horrible at this game. Okay, we're just gonna forget the damsel on that one then. Um, we're gonna pretend like that never happened. Oh, and we're gonna hold on to the rope so we don't lose. And I think that arrow trap has not been fired yet. Uh, kind of hate this, but I'm gonna use... Oh god, this run is doomed. Is this like the never ending level? How far do I, down do I have to go? Okay, this is, okay, this is the bottom. Oh, run, run, run. Okay, this is the bottom. So let's just run along the bottom because we know the exit is on the bottom. There it is, okay. Jeez, was that a dead or restless level? No, that was just the ghost. Okay, sorry, I got confused there. You can't have a dead or restless level, I don't think, that early on. So... The Mines Part 1 Dash 2. Here we are again. And there is. Oh my gosh. Well, hello there, shotgun. It's a good thing I can't afford you. Um, but I can get the spike shoes in this bomb bag. So, uh, good riddance, shotgun. I don't need you. Uh, let's trigger this arrow trap with this. I think that'll work. Oh, it's already been triggered. Okay, perfect. Um. Gold is good, rocks are useful, and the shopkeeper was plentiful on this level. And oh! <sighs> you know, I'm starting to get to the point where I can see. Oh my god, that was like a ninja skeleton. Did you see him? He's like flying in. Crazy. Oh, okay. Uh, I thought I could get them both there on like the, the jump down. But anyways, so, oh wow, hello Mr. Spider. Um, not worth it, I don't even care about you. But anyways, so I'm starting to get to the point where I can like see my impending doom like ahead of me. And you know, that's kind of scary because it's, you know, you'll notice I, I, I let out a little shriek right before I get hit. And uh, yeah, so, oh, oh my god. <laughs> Uh, as you can see, I just did it again. Oh my god. Get a load of this girl. She's just... She is in... She's just... I don't even know. She's something. She is something. Maybe she needs to get her prescription checked. She's, or maybe this character isn't the good luck that I need her to be. She, I mean, she hasn't really done that much, you know, greatness for us. Maybe I should go back to Pirate Girl. Who knows? I don't know. Maybe there should be a, a Bring Back Pirate Girl revolution or something. And then I might do that. So we'll see. We'll see on the next episode if I really feel like being Glasses Girl because she's kind of a letdown. Uh, I really shouldn't be blaming the, the character. Uh, don't hate the player, hate the game, right? That's that's how that stupid quote that everybody keeps saying goes. Um, yeah, that is how it goes. Oh. And fall damage. God, she's like just committing suicide here, I believe. She's just, she's just done with it all. Spiderwebs. This is how I feel about my splunky career. Just shimmering by and just squeezing through and going slow and painfully. And this is how I play spelunky all the time in my head. Anyways, so let's go, let's just move on here. And what level are we on? Are we even close to the jungle yet? Mines. One, one complete, oh my god, I'm getting runs mixed up, I forgot that I restarted again. Um, let's see here, let's jump down, jump down, oh, and go down this way and get some gold. So, you know, it's kind of like, it's kind of like maybe this little girl's headband is like blocking blood flow to her brain, because she keeps doing stupid 
shit like like that like that was really dumb like I'm, I'm getting to the point where I feel like I'm just watching this character do things like it's not me I promise this is just the character I mean look at her she's looking up she she's like I'm I'm totally fine with everything I can do I can do whatever I want to do I can look up and I can look down oh god she's freaking crazy this girl this girl is intense all right let's just move on Oh, we can take the rock with us. I forgot we could do that. You know? That's a good thing to, to remember. So we can take this rock so we can trigger arrow traps with it, hopefully. And I hate spider levels. Oh, this is the worst. This is the worst, to say the least. Oh my god. Spider levels just mean that... That's pretty much what it means. It means I'm gonna be dead by spiders. And look at this. Ugh, could you imagine being in a place like this? Like, God. Oh, jeez. What did I do that for? Um, that guy's gonna be stuck up there, though, so it's fine. Um, but yeah, could you imagine being in a place like this? Like, in oh, of course that's where the damsel is. But I mean, come on. This is like... This is like the worst place. I would never want to be here. Ever. Like, not... Oh, crap. And that spider has been triggered. Okay. But no, I would never want to be here. Not in a million years would I be standing on this place. I would just faint. I would be... Oh, hi there. I would faint. So, I don't know if the damsel is gettable, to be honest with you. As you can see, we're standing in the middle of spiders. Um, I'm going to just... Uh, evasive action! Evasive action! <laughs> Everybody quick, run! We're going to forget that all of that ever existed. And we're going to move on with our lives. And we're gonna be happy about it. So, ooh, what the heck is this? I think that must be, there must be a spider in there. I mean, when you see a bunch of webs, oh, no! It's death by spider every time. Every freaking time. Okay, let's try this again here. I told you I was gonna die by a spider on that spider level. I mean, it just makes sense. Um, let's see, let's just go down this way. Okay, there's a bat here, slowly but surely. I will get the hang of killing bats. I hate bats. Ugh, bats. And gold, and snakes, and arrow traps. And I didn't see the damsel anywhere. But I'm not really all that great at clearing out levels properly. I've noticed I don't really hit- Oh! Ooh, I caught myself on that one. I thought I was going to take damage, but I didn't, so. Anyway, so we're just going to pop our little selves into the exit and try to move on here in a timely manner. And here's the pot with a spider in it, which I'm just going to ignore, because screw that, am I right? That's what killed me on the last level. I'm not going to just try to ma make friends with the spider, try to make up with him, like, Oh, hey, I'm sorry I killed your last run. Please be friends with me, little glasses girl. No, forget it, man. You broke my heart one too many times. I will never... Oh, no. <laughs> I will never- oh, did I throw a bomb too? God, I, I always do that. When I try to use ropes, like, in crazy cool ways like that one did, I always freaking, um, throw a bomb as well. But, sorry, I, like, totally lost the train of thought, because I thought that arrow was, like, just in mid-go. Mid-go, yeah. <laughs> like, um, mid-projectile, because, and when I, ki when I killed the web, I thought it was gonna, like, come at me, but it didn't. So anyways, um, so that was just needless. But what I was saying, yeah, I'm not gonna forgive the spider for breaking my heart one too many times. You know, and look, there's his, there's his, like, older brother, like, just to be even meaner about everything. Let's see, let's get the spike shoes and the bomb box and get the hell out of Dodge. Oh, God! <laughs> he almost landed right on my skull! Okay, he didn't, though, so. We be good here. And this is, um, it's looking good to go this way, I think, actually. Let's get these. Oh, no! I always do that. I always misjudge. And I only have one rope left, so I gotta be more careful. I gotta be more careful about the situations that I get myself into. And that these there's spike traps here. And let's see. Oop. And dropping down. Good, good, good. I'm getting better about, um, how, like, how much... Uh, height I can go through before I take fall damage if I get you know if I fall from too high. Oh, there's the exit already. Okay, good 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 and we're gonna follow the damsel. But anyways, yeah, like I was saying I'm, I'm better with judging the fall damage ratio. I think you know, I, I know What's risky what's safe and I was still always buy parachutes though just in case um 
yeah, there's the damsel. Okay, so that's good. And there's the spiders here. Not too worried about them. And I should probably be worried about them because they've been ending my runs a lot today. I think maybe, maybe just once, but I mean, once is enough. Once is enough, you know? You've had your heart broken once, you know how it feels. And it's, it don't feel good. I'm here to tell you. So, let's, um... Oh, there's a, oh, two alive skeletons. What are the odds? Okay, there is an arrow trap here that I think the damsel can afford to trigger with her skull and not mine. And please don't come alive. You didn't. Good. Thank you for listening to me. Not many men do. And there's another spider. Okay, these spiders are starting to get real annoying. Okay, look, there's that guy. Look, he's, he's going to try to, like, run that way, but he's not going to be able to get to us. Ha-ha! Huzzah! And we're actually doing really good with getting damsels. And we're at 7 health on the jungle. Wow, guys, this is this is amazing. This this last part of this run is starting to go great. Okay. This is the run. Okay. Don't don't freak yourself out about it, but this this might be this might be the one. The jungle is so much harder though. I'm so bad at the jungle. Okay, let's drop down this way. No, cuz then we can't get Okay, we're just going to drop down this tree, nice and safe. And there's frogs. I don't worry too much about the frogs. I should probably worry more about the frogs, but I don't. Um, we're gonna go this way, because it seems safer. And the exit is there. What's down there? What is that? Okay, that's just a man that we can drop on. Good. Okay. Didn't see the damsel. She was not in my vision, so I shall not go searching for her on the jungle. In the jungle, survival is the most important thing. We've stacked enough health for now. Um, there's piranhas in there, so I gotta be real careful. And there's a, t a tiki trap here, and another frog, which I don't like. Um, and I know that you can't kill these guys um, with the spike shoes, so... There. And he doesn't actually die, so just get him. Just throw- Oh, sh shit. God, that scared the crap out of me. What are these bubbles? Oh, that's a snail. Yeah, there's a snail coming. Okay, so we're gonna just try to drop down onto this frog. Okay, there's a guy with an arrow. Or not an arrow, a boomerang. So we're gonna- Maybe we can just, like ignore him altogether? Yeah, let's try to go on. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh, bees. Okay, great. So, I've never experienced bees before, but apparently, um, uh, I've never, like, been this stressed out about bees. I think I've seen them before, and I may have, like, actually dealt with them okay, but I have never been, uh, whoops. Crap, that would be my computer being really stupid. Anyways.